Hi friends! For wool fibers, strength is one of the most important features along with length and thinness. Since strong yarn can be produced only with strong fibers, strength is a required qualification for fibers. Fiber strength directly affects the yarn strength. The stronger the utilized fiber is, the stronger the produced yarn is. During the yarn production, fibers are generally exposed to tension related to several reasons. It is desired to use strong fibers that do not break off during the production process. The fibers, which have low strength, cause the fibers breaking off in the producing process, dust formation, the loss of fibers and increasing in fibers breaking off. Low strength fibers that break off during production may cause dust, fiber partitions and, of course, low strength yarn that eventually breaks off. Currently, we are to measure the length of fiber bunch with the Presley device. Firstly, we install the sample nippers into the proper apparatus. We lift this part up. We make sure that the nippers are completely fastened to each other. And we squeeze the screw like this. We make sure that the nippers are fixed. Once the nippers are ready, we prepare the fibre sample to be placed into the nippers. Some fibre is taken out. We straighten it by using hands. We remove its dust. We smooth its irregularities. Once it appears to be smooth and ready, the device's reed is utilized. Firstly, like this. In order to prevent its reed being damaged, the reed is utilized firmly from the right to the left, then from the left to the right. We repeat this process one more time. And we can now place the fibre. The nippers are closed like this. And then this handle is lowered down. We squeeze the nippers firmly. We hold the bottom part with our hands. We squeeze the screw until the bottom part turns. We see it is turning and our screws are completely squeezed. Now we are raising the handle. We loosen this part. We are taking out the nippers slowly. By the help of a special knife or razor blade, we hold it like this so that it can be cut from the zero point. We make sure that both sides of the nipper do not contain any remaining fibers. As can be seen, there is no fiber left on either side. Now, we install our nippers into the device. In order to do it, we raise the device like this. And we place the nippers like this. And then we loosen them. And that arm is raised. The value here is red, a value between 10 
and 20 means that the test has been performed correctly. Then we remove the nippers. It is opened firmly after the removal. It is observed that there is no remaining fiber. That means the break-off is realized. The next task is to install the nippers into the device again. Firstly, we fasten the nippers together. Then we place them to the relevant part. We squeeze that screw. And then we loosen the screws that are squeezed a while before. The fibers should be placed into the balance of 10,000 to 1 sensitivity by help of tweezers at once. By putting the values obtained from the scale and the balance into the relevant fields of form, we obtain the strength of the fiber bunch with the Presley device. 